Mr. Peter Obi of the Labour Party don't drop another banger, my correct people. He don't come aside they let the general public they know say this government of Bola Ahmed Tinibu they operate four different national budgets and all of them at the same time. And he said this one they indicate say the leaders they need out of touch with reality and they lack the competence to manage our nation's finances effectively. No be small matter, my correct people. I still bring another information where I would like someone give all of Una. Like this now, eh? the European Union don't they advise the federal government. Say me then tackle poverty with financial interventions. Sake of say, it they very much critical if they want to reduce poverty for inside this our country, Nigeria. Now, without wasting much of your time, eh? make I give you the details of this information, of this headline where I just summa you so. The Koko be say, the former presidential candidate of the Labour Party, will be Mr. Peter Obi, in Don De Yano, say the Nigerian government under President Bola Ahmed Tinibu, they implement four national budgets at the same time. And he say evidence they will, say all evidence now don't confirm them. Say this this Koko we in Yan so na legit. And my correct people, Mr. Peter Obi, in the drop this statement on Saturday for inside in official ex handle. And for inside that social media, now the former Anambra State Governor Konde Yanu say the development is in blatant disregard for fiscal responsibility plus transparency and accountability. And now the recipe for chaos, confusion, and catastrophe. Because this intentionally reckless action it will only lead to the increased suffering of country people. And these developments by the federal government, they indicate, say, the leaders now, they need out of touch with reality. And they, they lack the competence to manage the finances of our nation effectively. And Peter will be constantly young, no more correct people. Say, this deliberate act of recklessness, the elected representatives of the people, they follow the duam, thereby they, they betray one of the cardinal pillars of democracy. Meanwhile, leaders... They are elected to responsibly manage public resources in an organized way. So, in the respectively appeal and, in fact, in the demand, say this situation now be reversed immediately, in preference for more responsible and transparent approach to budgeting. He said we must prioritize the needs of the Nigerian people, not the selfish interests of a few. And this now call to action for all leaders to come up body from actions we go further drive the country into economic chaos. It's a neither the National Assembly nor the executive then get any excuse to promote or justify this their bad behavior and will they seek and insist on a nation where they governed by leaders where they very much responsible in their handling of public resources. And this is the only way we feel build a great nation. So that's my correct people now the things and things where Mr. Peter Obi talk concerning the matter for inside in official ex handle. Since so Mr. Peter Obi now man will be say he no the fear to talk in mind. He don't hear and they give the general public on the things and things where he don't observe. And he don't still urge the federal government say may them reverse the situation sharp sharp to promote more responsible and transparent approach to budgeting. My correct people, anyhow, where this information be you for body, you are free to drop it inside our comment section. So, moving on to the next information where I bring come for you. The Tory BC, the European Union don't call on the federal and state governments to increase financing for social protection interventions as it is critical to reducing poverty across the country. Now, according to one statement by the Commission on Saturday, the head of the cooperation of the EU delegation to Nigeria and ECOWAS, and he named now Massimo De Luca. Now they yarn this one, now they make this call on Friday during the third edition of the Social Protection Cross Learning Summit for Inside Abuja. And a day away, Massimo De Luca can they describe social protection as a fundamental pillar supporting the most vulnerable and poor households, providing not only a safety net but also a beacon of hope for poor and vulnerable individuals and community. And you see this particular summit, whether they yarn or this one so, eh? It is organized by the Federal Ministry of Finance 
in collaboration with the Social Protection Development Partner Group with the team Social Protection Towards Human Capital Development. To be small matter, my correct people. According to Mazimo De Luca, he says social protection eh, it they play a critical role in human capital development by providing safety nets we will ensure access to essential services such as education plus health and nutrition including contributing to economic stability poverty reduction and inclusive growth laying a strong foundation for the overall development of the country and in they talk about the report of the world bank where they put poor old nigeria at 104 million or 46 percent for inside 2023 in say investing in social protection it equally mean investing in our collective future and it will boost resilience and it will ensure say every individual now get opportunity to contribute meaningfully to the society despite their background despite their location or despite any uncertainties them and Oga Mazimo de Luca constantly yarn about the commitment of the European Union to collaborating with the federal government towards addressing issues around poverty for inside with country. He said the, the EU now will be European Union that they support the country Nigeria's social protection sector to the tune of 46 million euro for their 2021 to 2027 programming to support system strengthening and design of social safety nets program. And he said already they only finalize the process with UNICEF and GIZ to implement the project in the focal states. Oga de Luca consider Yano say the intervention now it will support the strengthening of social protection system. And according to him, he said they look at interoperability of related database and ensuring functional stock responsive social register while supporting three states for inside the northeast with safety net program we could target climate change affected communities so that's my correct people now the information concerning the matter like this now the advice we the young give our president and the support where they come from the european union a massive don't be small don't forget anyhow the coco be you for body they are free to drop it inside our comment section no, say now we be anointed lady TV and now they give the obonge and legitimate information concerning the things and things that happen for inside this week country Nigeria. So if you go like to the receive news like that, make you subscribe to this channel and make you put on the notification bell so that as they bring the news they come, now you go first get the updates and you go get them sharp sharp. And I beg not to stingy with the news, try to share to your family and friends so that them too they go know what they happen for inside our country Nigeria. I they come with another update for you, my correct people. No go anywhere.